Oh dear. Look how many people are on. That can only mean one thing. Hello everyone. Welcome back to Hermitcraft. The day has come where the flag is coming down. And it's very scary. There's a lot of people on now. The vault is officially finished. I just wanted to quickly show you. And is there people in the base? What's... Impulse? It... it the, the sea in... What? It's just vanished. The ceasefire flag is still up. They can't be in the base. What's going on? I've gotten rid of all of my useful stuff. I don't want to lose... I don't want to lose all my tools. <sighs> okay. Panic over. Right. So this is the vault. Let's go... Let's go and get prepared ASAP. Quickly. We need to go to the armory before we meet everyone at the flag. If I go in here, it should dispense everything that I need. Absolutely brilliant. So is Impulse here or not? What? Okay. Well, I'll take the TNT. Someone has put some invisible armor stands to trick us. There's actually no way out of here, so I'm going to have to put that TNT back. Anyway, no time to dilly-dally. We need to get ourselves together and meet at the flag. I think I'm actually late. Oh, boy. Here we go. Whew. I hope you're ready, base, because this is going to be very explosive. Hope everyone's ready. Look at look at your uniforms. Oh, my goodness. Iskal? <laughs> Someone didn't get the memo. I thought it was fancy dress up day, not fancy dress What what are you wearing, Iskol? What is that? Wait, the more important question is what are you guys wearing? Power Ranger outfits? Uh so guys, I'm I'm having second thoughts about this, you know, because I don't know about you, but we've spent a lot of time building up this base. This is like a whole season's worth of work put in, in here, so, you know, is it, is it worth it? You know, I don't know if I want to do this. Uh, you're getting cold, you're afraid I'm gonna, you're afraid I'm gonna put holes in it with my gas cannon, aren't you? Yes! I mean, oh, man. <laughs> what, guys, guys, I mean, guys be, be quiet, be quiet. What is that? I hear chicken. Chicken noises. <laughs> oh, no! Oh. No, it calls me a chicken. Come well, on, man. why don't you put your action where your words are and take down the flag? Yeah, you take it down. No, you take I, it down. I, 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 I would, but I've we just like got a pickaxe. I don't even have an axe on me. <laughs> <laughs> you take down the flag. I don't want to be culpable for this. Well, well neither do we. Uh, yeah. No, no, it's on Somebody's you Somebody's got to take down the flag. Come on. Nope. Oh, 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 my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Goodness! Come on! You guys, shots fired! Shots fired! So many shots like fired! So, well, I guess, I guess the flag's down. Yeah, the flag is down. Flag is down. <laughs> <laughs> guys, 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 back to the base. I'll, I'll, I'll get your stuff. G team. Okay, it's, it's happened. I. I, I will admit, I didn't really want to fight them, but it's happening. Cub clearly wants to fight, you know, to go down, so... some Well, at least he's going to be making some money, am I right? Okay, so there's a relative uh, peace going on at the moment. When the flag came down, we've retreated to our base, and we need to actually plan some stuff out. Oh, what the hell? I just... <laughs> oh! Oh my god! I spoke too soon. Uh, okay, oh, okay, okay, okay. Forget that. Tango, <laughs> Tango, Iskel, you're on. Go go to the control room. Do the thing, do the thing. Yeah. <laughs> Stress, yeah, you're yeah, with me on the yeah, battlefield. Yeah. Jevin and Cleo, right, you're on defensive okay. duties. Okay. Go, 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 go. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I can't even see out there. Why Why can't I see outside my own window? Hello. Uh, stress, 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 stress. <laughs> on the horses, on the horses. Have you got the I stuff got you need? I've got my stuff on me, no. Oh. I, need, I, need to, I need to go and get ready. We're so unprepared. You know me, <laughs> I need shoes. Okay. Right. I'm, I'm gonna get some potions for us, and we gotta, we gotta go, 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 go. Are you ready? Are we on? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Come over here. Come over here. We need to leave. We need to leave via our secret entrance, exit rather. Oh, oh. Over here. Where? Quick, 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 quick. There's no stress. I cannot stress <laughs> enough that there's no time. Well, what are you doing? Stress. <laughs> we need horses. Where are this? you? This? No, the other way. Look. Look, okay, right, come, chill, <laughs> chill, stress, right here, come on. I'm so sorry. <laughs> this is the way we've got to get out. <sighs> All right, okay, we're off. <laughs> All right, there's a sword behind you, present. There we go, hey, quick, 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 quick,
<laughs> Alright. Uh oh. <laughs> uh -oh. Help me! There's nothing I could do for you now. <laughs> oh. No! He's gonna murder me! Go, 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 go! There's no time! You, okay, go, 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 go. Get a horse, get a time. horse, and let's get out of here. All right, I'm taking this horse. Uh, <laughs> please be a good horse. <laughs> let's go. We're off. I'm going, we're going straight up. Yeah, we're going straight up, okay. Oh, oh, the, f the horse is on fire oh. up here. No! <laughs> splash. Now, splash. <laughs> this should work. All right, okay. You ready? <laughs> Flying horses, here Stop we go. <laughs> Uh, no, it definitely no! didn't. <laughs> well, there goes that plan. All right, let's go, 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 go. That only took like We're two off. hours. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. There's so much going on here. There's a guardian. What? He's oh you. no. Oh. Uh, oh, we're not gonna. We're not gonna get in here. There's too much fire. Oh my goodness. I'm just we, target we need, practice. Do you see him? Oh, I'm on fire. I don't even know. That. What do we do? Stress. I have no idea. I completely didn't bring anything for long <laughs> This I is the worst saw. attack ever. I'm gonna try and I'm we gonna try and take anywhere. care of I'm gonna try and take care of impulse. <gasps> oh, ow! Oh no 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 no! No! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die. I've got an idea. Oh, oh this okay, slow falling is the worst. I My, did I, I didn't bring milk. We've die. just made this so much worse for ourselves. <laughs> they haven't actually done that much damage to our base at all. Right, they I'm thinking really we need okay. to create a barrier between us and them. Here, take some TNT. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna lay a line, oh okay? My God. We're gonna lay yep, a line. Yep, yep, yep. And we're gonna blow we're gonna make our own trench so they can't get <laughs> past us so easily. Oh nice thinking. If any of them come near, we set it off. <laughs> they're they're all being winds though. They're not they coming are. near us. They're just they're just sitting on their fort. We should taunt impulse. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> no, I died! I am probably gonna die! <laughs> Where did I oh, I see. Oh, God. <laughs> Woo -wee. Oh, no, I have nothing. Oh, I live, I live to tell another tale. Oh, my goodness. Oh, what okay, a mess. I'm well, we've, we got our again. wish of a trench. Oh, you still firing them? How many fire charges did I have? Oh, it's nice. No, They've gas. got a gas. They've got unlimited. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I'm not sure either of us can actually <laughs> get to the other. <laughs> Look at Tango's machine go. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Tango looks so majestic up there. Like, he's like lord of this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, can my I goodness. Can I I can. Hold on. I see, our, I see our man on the inside. I, I'm going gonna, I'm oh. gonna, gonna to have to go off to the side for a second, stress. Okay. I see our man on the inside. I've just messaged him saying over here. Psst, Mumbo! I'm on my way. The sneakiest. <laughs> over here, over here, over here, over here. Okay. Um, absolute chaos. Dude, you didn't tell me that it was going to be this crazy. I'm trying my <clears> best <throat> to not kill the other team, but also look like I'm trying to kill the other team. No, that's fine. That's fine. I, un I, un I totally understand. Wasn't quite expecting <laughs> Apocalypse, being honest. Yep. <sighs> So, what what info can you can you give? What, what's going on? Okay, so here's the thing. We have TNT cannons in the moat. Yeah. Okay, we've got the gas cannon. You've experienced that. It's not as powerful as we thought, so we're kind of let down by that. There right. are intercontinental, intercontinental creepers coming into your base, though, in maybe a minute and a half. Oh, so, great. Yeah. Oh, I mean, boy. we launched them. See, 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 Doc didn't tell us, so he launched them. He was like, we're in a time of need. We need to launch the creepers. So we launched them. And then I was waiting for something dramatic to happen, but they take three minutes to land. <laughs> so. Oh. And how did our zombies go? Did, did did they do anything? They actually, they gave us definitely a bit of a fright. But yeah, I mean, you know, there was four of us down there. It was, it went well and it was very impressive. It was very strange killing zombies with my own head. <laughs> uh, that was a bit bizarre. But okay, so the quick war is out of the window. We're gonna yeah. need. This is gonna last a bit longer than I thought. We're gonna need you to fulfill your order. So what we need to do now is like organize a little place where we're gonna exchange information. Yeah. So where, where's a good where's a good place for us to exchange books from this point forward?
Mm. Maybe we could continue Under using the shopping district because then you can go yeah. in, go into a shop as usual on the cash, yeah. on the cash, yeah. and then every time we exchange yeah. a note, we tell each other where the next meeting place will be or the next exchange point is. The first one's going to be in False's fish shop. Okay. Right. Okay. So okay, keep an eye out for sure. that. All right. Okay. Shall I get back to my my team now? Yeah, but we should look like we're fighting, right? So, yeah, that's what, that's what I was hit, just about to say. Yeah, yeah let's hit. Uh, yeah. <laughs> make okay. sure, make sure they're watching. Let's go. Let's go and like get in front of people. Like maybe I'll. Look, yeah. you, you run. I'll chase you. you ch I'll, I'll chase you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 I'm gonna get oh, you. Oh, I'm gonna get you, little there. mole. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> big teeth <laughs> and. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> It looks like looks like the fighting's like, oh I thought the fighting was over. It's definitely not over. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> At the sound of the tone, time is mortal peril. Oh, and truer words have never been written on a sign. I think we're gonna call it. I think we've gotta retreat. Retreat! <laughs> retreat! X is here! Get him! Ow! I'm getting hit by my own fireballs! <laughs> they tried to use the doorbell! I'm back! I'm back! I'm back! I'm back! <laughs> They're by our front door! I know! I can see that! They <laughs> killed Gertrude! Who is Gertrude? The witch! The door lady! Oh. <gasps> She's no. gone! They killed her? That is mean! Oh my goodness! How did they do that? Oh, oh it's... my god! No! False is wearing Cleo's head! <laughs> oh my god! Uh, oh my she's god. a much better shot than me! Are you out there alone? Yes! <laughs> oh, what are you doing out there? Iskul's out there! Iskul's with you on the battlefield! Oh, you clicked in. I'm calling it! We gotta retreat! Retreat! <laughs> Retreat! 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 Oh, we, no, lost a, we lost our man on the ground! Retreat! No! Retreat! <laughs> we need to go and join. Oh, we need to get the high ground. <laughs> Retreat! That? They're retreating as well. It's too much. There's too much. I Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. <laughs> Look at the state of the place. <sighs> yeah, you be scared. Yeah, you you yeah. run. We need to regroup, I think, and work out our next point of attack. Like we, neither of us succeeded. Minimal damage, absolutely everywhere. Oh, there we go. Hello? There we go. Minimal damage, <laughs> is, everybody. Is the secret weapon being used? Oh, it's already been used. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's I missed used. it. <laughs> oh, I bet that we looked deployed, well good. We play a couple hundred zombies on their base. <laughs> Oh my Firestorm god. Zombie. Regroup. I Regroup at the meeting room, shall we? Looks like we're safe yes. for now. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It looks like we got away with minimal damage, everyone. Absolute <sighs> yeah. chaos out know. there. I see our front of our base burning. But... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was getting a bit stuffy in here anyway. Okay, looks Report. like. <laughs> it looks from the battlefield. <laughs> <laughs> looks like there was a lot of exchanging of fire, but not actually that much damage. So it looks like this isn't going to be a very quick war in the end. We're going to have to no. play the long game and we're going to have to infiltrate. And I think that's our next bit because I don't actually, I couldn't get close. The moat was annoying. No. There was no, no. clear entrance. We're going to have to find out the weak points. We're going to have to do some recon. And then we're going to have yeah. to try and make our way in that way. So we've got to plan carefully. But at the same time, we've got to trap our base because it is yeah. so easy to get in our base. Not going to oh, lie. Oh, it really is. Oh, yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. So we've got to make it yeah, hell yeah, for them. True. Everyone in agreement? <laughs> All right, yeah. yeah Agreed. Yes. Okay, cool. Now, remember, everyone, this war is not a faction war. We're not out just to destroy their base. I could walk in there with 10 stacks of TNT and end this thing right now. But that's not how we do on the Hermitcraft server. That's we right. want to have a fun fight. Okay? Yes. Let's keep yes. it clean. Let's keep it Absolutely. mean. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> During the fighting, I actually set up my camera account to watch what was going on. It's not quite as impressive, but here's a quick time lapse of how everything went down. This is the time lapse, and it is pretty chaotic. Guess who forgot to press F1 again? Me. So it was absolute anarchy, but this is a really good opportunity to tell every single one of you that we had a great time. No one broke any rules. No one was upset. We absolutely loved every second of it. And afterwards, we all got in a call, and we absolutely giggled and laughed about how fun it was. So please, 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 
No negative comments on anyone. I want you to support absolutely everybody's videos if you can. Thank you very much, guys. Also, I did actually mention, but we've got some military uniforms, which is really cool. This is like my super British one, and everyone has one from where they're from, which is why Iskow was in a weird blue uniform, because the Swedes have got a, a strange one. That fight was super interesting, chaotic, and a lot of fun. It was pretty much everything I hoped it would be. <laughs> there was a couple of hiccups, but... Everything went pretty well in the end. The only thing that I want to bring up is that Cub definitely... Oh, great. I need to fix this. There's no bucket of water in here. The only thing that I want to bring up is that Cub definitely did not mean to kill anyone. He told us afterwards he was just intending to bring the flag down and he set up a bunch of TNT beforehand so that he could bring the, the flag down. And <laughs> I don't think he meant for anyone to get hurt. So just to clarify that he's not getting involved in the war at this stage. He's just profiteering from his shop. Oh my sweet doggo. <laughs> Who do these belong to? <laughs> There's a straight up army of them. Oh my goodness. Well, we're not fighting with redstone, we're fighting with animals. <laughs> so now that the war has officially started, we really need to get our act together. We still don't have a lot of the logistics of our base. I think maybe we should repair some of the damage. But in all honesty, there wasn't actually too much damage done. There was a- f I don't know how all of these have turned to stone. I- I honestly don't know how these turned to stone. This is super weird. Maybe some pistons messed up? And we've also replaced Gertrude. She's back. <laughs> Thank you. Fr free potions. Thank you, G-Force. <laughs> we probably want to extinguish some of this. Because the entire battlefield is now on fire. It's actually a couple of days later now, so the fighting happened a while ago. But the, <laughs> the world is still on fire. <laughs> Either way, we need to figure out a way to get in. And we need a way to prevent them from gaining easy access into our base. I've got to admit, these signs really didn't do very well. And, uh, oh boy. I think it might be cool if we turned this into a, an actual, like, trench at some point. I think what we need to do is get into spy mode and try and figure out a way to get in to their base the way that they get in. It would be so easy for us to just charge in with a bunch of TNT. We need to use their front door. And we're not going to figure that out without a bit of espionage. So I had that little meeting with Mumbo over there during uh, the fight of all things. And we agreed that we're going to exchange mole reports in the shopping district. <laughs> and try... Ooh, yeah, this is not good. This is This is not good here. So, while we're both being in espionage stage, I think an idea would be to make it seem like we've got a secret entrance, like maybe here. This would work quite well. So, what we do is we, we basically wait until we know that someone on the star team or team star is watching us. And then we pretend like we can't see them. And then we run inside here and then we hide. And then they will try and follow us in and then set off a trap. That's that's the plan. Whether it actually works out that way, I'm not entirely sure. Or maybe it even could be an actual way into the base. Now, why is there a sea lantern right here? So, what kind of trap could we put in here? Well, I guess we can discuss what kind of trap's going to be in here in the comments. However... In the next couple of days, I'm going to be uploading a video with a bunch of trap ideas in it. And maybe we can take a bit of inspiration from them. Because I basically made that video because this whole thing was going down. And I'm hoping that we can use some of them to our advantage. However, because it is a video, they will also see them. But I'm hoping that this little false entrance here could end up being a very cool trap during the espionage stage of this war. It obviously looks like an entrance or exit out of the base, and that's the point. We really want to lead them in here. We also need to come up with a few other little traps outside the base. So while we know that they're spying on us, 
we can uh, trick them into going in and out of traps. Like, we could even change that one into a trap. We could move the stable, like, show them the way in here, and then trap it all. So they'll never know which way to get into our base, except there's a giant hole there. <laughs> there's a g there are Guys, I, um, I think I found a flaw in our base design. I think the last thing that we need to do is figure out the place where... We're going to exchange information with Mumbo. We need something like a furnace. Not the ch we need uh, we need a proper a proper thing. We need a, a chest or something, a furnace, something that isn't going to be found again. Oh, there's a lot of puffer fish for sale. I could definitely use these. I might come back to this shop anyway. I have an idea, guys. This is how we're going to communicate. I'm going to take one of these fish. Don't worry, we're not stealing him. We're just taking him on a little ride for a second. We're going to rename him, hit the button behind the castle times two. And then we're gonna take him back, put him right where he was. The chances of somebody taking this fish or buying this fish before Mumbo gets his hands on it is very slim indeed. So we'll put him back in here. And then Mumbo can come in here and read this. Hit the button behind the castle times two hopefully he'll sit here like yeah so he'll look at it and he'll see he'll look at all these fish because that's what i'm going to tell him to do and it'll say hit the button behind the castle times two. Ooh, bit stormy out there and then right under here and then right under here is where we're going to set up our little dispenser system so, so when he hits this button it should dispense an item so let's give it a little test there we go. If he dispenses it, it will dispense out his orders. Now here's the thing. I've got two books and quills here because we're going to give him two sets of orders. I've just written out both of these. So there's the mole orders. Now this is very simple. Orders, create a weapon for Team Star, but rig it to blow up when one of them uses it and blame someone on the G team if they ask. Okay, very, very simple. Now the second book says the real orders. Okay, the mole orders are not the real orders. These are. You need to game Team Star's trust. In order to do that, you need to show them the other book that you have and let them in on your secret plan and use it against Team G. Do whatever it is that they say in regards to weapons. Maybe rig it to blow up in blow up us instead of them or something. The main point is you need to gain their trust to show that you really are a double agent and not a triple agent or a quintuple agent. I forget. Don't mess this up, Molbo Gumbo. P.S. Good luck. From G. So basically, what I want him to do is to go, Hey, hey, hey guys, hey Team Star, hey False, hey, hey Doc. Uh, I've just been given my mole orders. Here they are. And then they can see, yep, this looks legit. Signed by Green and everything. Look, original by Green. And these are the orders, so he can like say like, look guys, I've been given this orders, maybe we can use this against them. But in reality, he's been told to do that by us to try and gain their trust. Hopefully this works. This is like, this is awesome. Like, <laughs> so he needs to just hit this button twice. One, two, and out they come. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Okay. There's my little bit of espionage done. We need to get our man on the inside to do some work for us because at the moment we know nothing and there's a lot of info to gather, but we need our man on the inside to be trustworthy in their eyes. All right, I'm afraid that's all it is for me. This is very exciting, everybody. <laughs> I hope that you've enjoyed it. Please let me know all of your thoughts and feelings down in the comment below. And remember, this is all for fun, and we're still all very good friends. So no need to leave any hate in anyone's comments. In fact, I want you to support absolutely everybody, including the other team, in their videos. Thank you very much for watching, everyone, and good.